Okay, so Mabel said that Daniel and Jason had an update on my house. Uh, does not keep them waiting. Town looks different from this angle. Like I've been, I've been helping for the past like week and a half um, building. Pretty much everyone has that hasn't had another job, but you know it looks a bit different depending on the angle you're looking at it. Hello, Maxie. Help. Eleonora went overboard. I'm gonna need help now. Uh, with the farm? Oh, jeez. She did go overboard. Like, how far does this go? I hope she didn't tire herself out again. Oh, wow. Just keeps going. Oh, I guess they got the barn. Um, set up like they've been wanting to. I am confused on where the running water set, uh, is, cause, like, yeah, there's patches of water in the farm. Uh, gee, of course to help with irrigation, but, uh, there's no running water. Strange. Oh, I got, looks like they got the orchard set up. Guess that'll help. Uh, anyways. Jeez. Just have been so many, like, buildings popping up every day that- or not every day, but like, it's been- yeah. Looks a lot more lively. For a second there, I thought the two of them were twins, but they're not. Good morning, everyone. Or good day, I should say. Um, <laughs> excuse me. All those buildings, not that I'm allergic, just dust is, dust cause cause, causes coughing. Just put it that way. Ooh, that is a nice guard tower. Uh, I guess Mabel's plan is to have several of these uh, throughout town. Really like the detail. Wonder how many guards they could fit into that one. I don't know. Uh, which, to be honest, the the amount that we've been able to get done, besides that being under construction, well, there's several buildings under construction, I should say. Uh, I th I feel we've gotten a lot done. Yeah, I like uh, <laughs> that singular torch that no one can get to up top. Uh, yeah, I like the design. I guess my, uh, sorry, brain, brain doesn't want to work today. Uh, I like the design of that, uh, tower. I guess Mabel wants to have, like, several of them spaced out through town, which honestly makes sense. So, like, if anyone needs help, they can... You know, they're there, or at least you know can get uh, get to the area quickly. Um, I guess that's Nova's shop over there. Yeah, uh, I think Galena, or I'm not Galena. Um, Eleonora, Eleonora's shop. She finally got the shop she wanted. Is over there. Um, still working on this part. Not sure what they want to do with it. Uh, I heard people talking about put, making it into a park or whatever. We s don't know for sure because we still need one more shop for Miles, I think. Yeah, I think it's Miles. Um, but yeah, we're going to hopefully take a break from building because everyone is exhausted. Or at least everyone that was on the team that I was on was exhausted. Uh... But yeah, uh, guess this is the way to, whoa, uh, hold on, whoa,
I didn't know they'd finished it. Jeez. Anyhow. Huh. I didn't realize you'd, you'd, you'd finished it. Jeez. What the? Good grief, guys. I didn't, like, I, I heard from Mabel that you had an update for me, but I didn't realize you guys had actually finished my house. Yep, we finished it late yesterday. It was tough to get some spots due to my height, but that's what I got Jason for. Ha ha. Um. Uh, is he okay? He literally has a mushroom through him. Uh, Daniel. No, I won't do one more thing. Z. Uh. I, I hope he's okay. I guess he's just tired. Oh, him? He'll be fine. I might have worked him a bit too hard. Tend to forget that humans don't have as much stamina as us of different species do. Might have worked him to the bone the past few days. Uh, should be fine after a few days rest, though. Or, or I hope so. Uh, okay, uh, shouldn't we get someone over here to help carry him back to his place, or... Don't worry about that, lass. See here this soul stone? I'll just put him in that and take him home. See? Now go get yourself acquainted in your new home. Oh, almost forgot. If you want more furniture and such, make sure to ask the next time a traveling merchant is in town. I'm sure they can hook you up with what you need. Oh, uh, thanks. I, I, I owe you one. Uh, actually, uh, make that several. Don't worry about it, lass. With you helping around town as much as you are, think of it as a repayment. Oh, uh, okay. Well, this is definitely not what I was expecting when, uh, Mabel said I should go check on them. Jeez, this is a nice house. Oh, I guess they left me a horse. Uh, don't know why. Um, okay. Uh, wait. Who is that? What? Who is... Uh... Uh, um, oh, okay, okay, uh, sh stra strange, that was, that was strange. I thought I saw somebody. Actually, no, not thought I saw, I did see somebody. Where did they, okay, uh, I guess I'll just go back and explore the actual house, um, it's not, Creepy at all, okay. Um, oh, well, oh, that's gonna be nice. No more having to do this. <laughs> um, I guess this is the kitchen. Well, that's not the kit. I guess this is like the living room area, and that's like the kitchen. I don't know. Uh, what's in here? Oh, guys, I guess knowing that I liked this tea um anyhow um I probably should go explore the house before I actually uh look at those boxes so I guess this is the downstairs it's set upstairs I guess um okay oh I guess this is the spare bedroom uh main bedroom question mark I guess I could figure figure that out for myself but I, I guess uh, that's my room I don't know now oh nice porch 
with the where the creepy dude was okay not gonna yeah let's just move on from that <laughs> uh get oh i actually have an attic space and it's lit up properly nice <laughs> Uh, okay, so I guess that's up good for our upstairs. Uh, do I have a bit? I guess I have a basement. Okay. This is new. Oh, wow. This is a bigger basement than I thought. Oh, nice. I guess this could be like my storage slash equipment area. I don't know. It's in... Oh! I have a spare bedroom here. And is this another one? Yep, this is another one. Okay, so uh, I guess this is a four bedroom. Hold on, one, two, there's two upstairs, and then yeah, there's a four bedroom. Four bedroom house, I guess? Uh, pretty new. Oh, looks like it's getting uh, a little dark outside. Um,. Well, I guess I'll hunker down for the night. Ooh, okay, that was a good good night rest. Uh, I found a bed in one of these. Yeah, I think it was this crate. Yeah, there it is. Um, so I guess that's that can go downstairs. Don't know why they gave me an anvil. I guess because of the sword. I don't know. Um, oh, I guess they took down my tent. Oh, I am standing on my bed. I guess they took down my tent, which, come to think of it, it was over there in that direction. Ugh. Okay, so let me get some of this stuff. Oh, alright, I guess I'll keep that for whenever I need to go camping again, I guess. Um... Guess I'll just grab all this stuff. Um, oh, <laughs> they know me well. They know I like Trillamix. Ooh, apple juice. That's new. Although I guess they did have um, giant orchard over where Maxi is. Which, uh, again, I hope they don't push themselves too hard. <laughs> Anyways, I guess I'll just head downstairs and get stuff organized. Okay, um... Oh! Hold on, let me... Uh... Yes? Uh, g give me just a second! I wonder who that is. Oh. Um. Yes? Morning. Uh, you're not busy, are you? Uh, wanted to give you an update on that key. Oh, and I also brought, uh, Blaze along. Um, wanted to give him some time to stretch his legs. Uh, no, I'm, I'm not busy. Um was just exploring and trying to place some stuff, you know, in my new house that I didn't even know was completed th this morning. Okay, uh, and th thanks. I, I meant to bring them along with me, but, uh, been distracted with all the building and everything lately. Well, hopefully him being here now will make it so that you actually remember to take him on walks and such. He seems to have taken a liking to you, so I'm pretty sure he wouldn't like it if someone tried to take him away from you. Uh, um, thanks? Apologies, uh, just have a soft spot for, for animals. Had one when I was young and she just disappeared on me one day. Haven't had a pet since due to not wanting to go through that type of pain again. Already having to do with the disappearance of my husband. Uh, okay, um, I'll, I'll try to, my best to take care of this little guy as much as I can. 
Apologies for my lax in taking care of him. Uh, wanna come in? Um, you said you had something to talk about? Um, sorry about having to put the table down. Or the table and chairs, I guess I should say. Uh, still not sure where I want to set stuff up, if you know what I mean. Don't worry about it, hun. Moving into a place can be daunting. Uh, anyways, I was going through my storage in my room and happened upon the key that my husband said to keep. Uh, I mostly forgot about it because that was around 20 years or so ago. Uh, he gave it to me a few months before he went missing. Okay. Uh, okay. Um. Oh, don't look so down, dear. I've had time to get over it, even if I've not completely gotten past it. But I always believed he left not by choice. Uh, not sure why, uh, but I'll call it instinct. Uh huh. Um, we'll call it that. Uh, maybe that spell he found about the. Ow! Dear, what is it? Is your head hurting again? I told you not to think about whatever makes your head hurt. Uh, um, it's difficult not to, uh, at times. Uh, I get this feeling that I'm not seeing everything I need to in certain surroundings. Uh, are, and are you okay? Uh, you look a bit, I don't know, freaked out? What? Oh, I'm fine, dear. Um, anyway, I I'm sure you have some questions for me since I've had that key uh, and that it might fit uh, into the wall that you found. Um, just so happened to be near my old house. Uh, no, I didn't really have any questions. Um, yeah. Nixie? Nixie? Are you alright? What? Oh, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I just had some random ringing noise in my ears. Do you think it's because you keep trying to remember your past? Huh. Don't... Didn't think about that. Usually I just get headaches, sometimes really bad ones, depending on how long I try and think of my past. But, uh, typically it's just a headache, but lately it's been, like, ringing in my ears. <coughs> what is it, buddy? Are you hungry? Uh, thirsty? Uh, treats? <sighs> what do you want then, buddy? <sighs> you know, this would have been nice. It, this is when it would have been nice to be able to communicate with animals. <laughs> uh, oh, he just suddenly... Okay. Maybe he needs to go poop? Maybe? I don't- I don't know. Um, he did just move closer to you, so maybe something you said bothered him? Huh? But it's not like I said anything bad to you. <coughs> uh, <laughs> I, I, I guess my assumption was right. What? I, I, I don't like to talk about it much. Uh, didn't know that Blaze here could detect when people are being dishonest and are hiding something. 
which is annoying if I'm to be honest with you. Um, well, I'm sure you had a good reason for hiding what you did. Everyone has their secrets, even me. I was hoping to not have to go into this again. Uh, go into... It has to do with my why my husband disappeared and something that happened this around this morning. When we were talking before in my old home, um, I was wasn't being completely truthful. Although I did try and search uh, for my husband and don't know where my husband went to. I do have a hunch as to why he left. Before everything happened, my husband was obsessed with figuring out the aftermath of the massive Rome-changing event that happened and made it so that the royal families just up and disappeared. He would find and or purchase anything that he could find on the topic. Even would trade his magic resources to do so, only to need to trade more to get said resources back because, in my opinion, it was stupid of him to trade them in the first place. Especially when he was the main source of production for the village at the time. W wait wait th there are two royal families? Yes, or at least there were until around 40 odd years ago. One day uh, they were here, uh, in this realm, and then the next day they just vanished. Wait, that's not- Ah! Dear, are you having one of those episodes again? What? What? Oh, uh, yeah, but you can continue. You sure? I don't want to be the reason uh, for you feeling discomfort. Yes, yes, I just can't think about, you know, too much. Harder to do than I thought it would be. Especially when some things I hear triggers my brain to attempt to think about something from back then. Alright, uh, as I was saying, the two royal families just up and vanished. Well, my husband never really believed that they vanished for no reason. So he would spend hours, sometimes days, weeks even, pouring over information on the event. Finally, he found a spell or something or other. I honestly don't know. By the time he found out, I was a bit fed up with the whole ordeal. Anyways, uh, he said he was going to go to his magic area, which I think was in a cave somewhere. Honestly, can't remember. And then just never came back. I spent the next several years looking everywhere, including every cave from here to the next several miles, but came up with nothing. Uh, like I said uh, the other day, I had almost given up uh, hope on finding him, but if I'm to be honest, for some reason I have this shred of hope that I will find him soon. Uh, again, don't know why. Uh, anyways, enough with going down my memory lane. Do you need anything? Food? More furniture? I'm sure if you asked around town, people would be willing to help you with odd, odds and ends, since you've helped as you have. Uh, if I'm to be honest, not really. Um, I ordered some furniture from the trader a couple of days, or at this point a couple of weeks ago, uh, and all I have to do is wait for it to arrive. I might ask Maxie for some plant seeds, because even though I know the town has this massive farm, I like to be, uh, self, uh, if I'm to be honest, what? Wah. Wah. Da <laughs> Hold on. Uh, if I'm to be honest, not really. Um, I ordered some furniture from the trader a couple days. I probably should. It's actually, no, it was a couple weeks back. Um, and all I have to do is wait for it to arrive. I might ask Maxie for some plant seeds. Because even though I know this town has a big farm, I like to be self-sufficient. Uh, might take me a bit to adjust to having my own home, though. 
But other than those things, I think I should be fine. Uh, thanks, though. Uh, didn't you say you had something else to add? Not just about your husband? Hmm? Oh, that. I wanted to ask if you felt something off since last night slash early morning. I uh, haven't felt something like that since... Why, since the major event that happened when the royal families disappeared. Uh, how old are you? Um, <laughs> no, uh, I haven't. Although, other than what my body looks like in faster healing, I don't have access to magic. So I can't detect magic disturbances in the world. Uh, sorry. True. Well, then, that's all I had to share for today, anyways. Uh, I guess I'll leave it to you, then. Oh, almost forgot. Uh, here's some cookies and a health potion. Uh, if you take the health potion, it'll immediately take effect. I'd also suggest carrying around at least one or two of these health potions with you because of the headaches you've been getting recently. Uh, it should help with the initial symptoms and uh, the after ones as well. Oh, uh, okay, thanks. Don't mention it, hun. I enjoy making these. As you know, uh, it's why I went to school when I was younger. Uh, well, I learned healing and light magic to help other people, that is. Uh, anyways, uh, I'll see you later. And just because you have a home now doesn't mean you can't stop by my home uh, from time to time for a meal or a chat, either. Uh, I'll keep that in mind. Uh, see ya. Uh, okay, um... Well, buddy, let's get, uh, get things organized, because I'm not sure if I want to keep that where it is or not. Um, if you're fine where you are, I'm just gonna head downstairs and start organizing. Thank you. 